Milligan's Gaming was a gaming store which was located in Colonial Heights, which I started working at back in 2018. I purchased it from uh, the owner and operating manager. We decided to move it to Johnson City for a bigger space. After the bigger space was found, which is 308 East Main Street, we decided to renovate and add a kitchen and bar and dining room. We decided to turn it into an Irish pub because it kind of went hand in hand with the gaming portion. Uh, we still sell games, we have games here and stuff like that, but unlike other restaurants, we want you to be able to come in, relax, it's a community space. Of course it'll be Americanized, but uh, spent some time with uh, some of the cooks and other people researching. So we have shepherd's pie on the menu. We also serve Guinness stew. I'm very confident saying that we have the best fish and chips within 100 miles. Um, proper pour of Guinness on top of other Irish or non-domestic beers on tap. Our bartenders from Dublin, Ireland. For the most part, all the staples are made in-house. Uh, every day and do our best to serve it to you hot, ready to come out, and it's simple food that is filling. That's the whole point. In fact, one of my goals is to go up to a table as they're getting close to another meal and ask them if they're ready for dessert. And if they say the words, no, I'm stuffed, that means I've done it right. On Friday and Saturday nights, usually starting somewhere between 6 and 8, we usually have live bands, and uh, those Bands typically are a little bit bigger, usually consist of full, full bands. We do move in the direction of singer-songwriters and acoustic, mainly because it's a pub, it's not a concert hall or a venue. Our whole point is we want people to be able to have conversations if they want to play games or dance or do whatever. It's all of the above. Wednesday, Thursdays, and Sundays, we have a couple who play Irish and Celtic tunes. The wife plays the fiddle, the husband plays the mandolin and the guitar, and that happens every week. We want the entertainment to be one of those things where people can come in and listen, have a good time, and not necessarily be driven out the door because it's too loud or they feel like it's being, it's being they're being rocked out. It's a big building, so there's plenty of space for people. You're never gonna come in and feel like you're crowded. And really, the whole point is, is we want people to come here because this is a family-owned business. Come here and feel comfortable enough to be like, yeah, this would be similar to like going to grandma's house. I hope you have the chance to come in sometime in the next couple days, weeks, or months. We always have beer ready. We always have the fish fryers ready. And there's always a home-cooked meal ready for anyone who steps in our door.